And this is music to my ears. Jeremy Montero has become the very first musician from Singapore to break into the top 50 of the U.S. jazz charts with the album Live at No Black Tie Kuala Lumpur. Well, Jeremy joins me now from his studio. Hi. Many congratulations, Jeremy. What a fantastic, to say the least, achievement this is. And in the middle of a pandemic, no less. So tell us, how does it feel to be the first Singaporean to, 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 to make this milestone? And how are you celebrating uh, your accomplishment? Well, thanks very much, Olivia. I'm glad. I, 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 you know, in fact, I'm really very excited that... Uh, that I, you know, managed to get on the jazz charts. It's been a long time. I, you know, I've had a forty-five year long career, so it's uh, it's been a long time to, to 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 achieve this milestone. And I hope that I will continue climbing up the charts. I've debuted at number forty-six, so hopefully the radio stations there will continue playing it. People will keep requesting it, and so it climbs up the charts. Uh, I'm not sure how I'm celebrating. Well, you know. I'm actually, my friend invited me for dinner tonight. So now he says that's uh, going to be uh, going to be the celebration. Uh, and, and he said, let's get drunk. I don't know about that. I don't drink that much, but certainly we'll celebrate. <laughs> well, fingers crossed, of course, that you do climb up the charts. Well, the reviews for the album have been fantastic. What are your plans for the rest of the year, Jeremy? Well, quite a lot. You know, I mean, I pretty much wear two hats, although I'm wearing one now. Uh, I, I, I run the, the I help to run the Jazz Association Singapore, which is a charity and arts charity in Singapore. And we have quite a lot of exciting shows coming up. We have our Jazz It Up show coming up on the 20th of uh, June on Father's Day, uh, to, to, which is a celebration of Chinese songs done in the jazz way. Uh, I also am waiting to see whether approval to do a small show at the Goodbye Garden at the substation over the weekend of the 11th of June. Not sure whether the approval will come through, but if it does, I'll be there. And you know, my live stream shows, I have my album project for the year. Uh, I'm sort of a workaholic, so I never stop. So I, you know, hopefully uh, people will continue to want to pay attention to me and what I do. Well, that's for sure. Jeremy, thank you so much for your time. And of course, congratulations once again. Before you go, our viewers will be in for a treat because you'll be playing us out. What song will you be playing from your new album? Well, I'm going to play a song that's uh, uh, called Mount Olive. It's, it's a really bright, swingy little tune dedicated to two great American musicians I had a band with for 20 years. Uh, it's called Mount Olive. And, uh, and for you, Olivia. Oh, wow. This Fabulous. Thank Mount you so much, Olive. Jeremy. <laughs> take it away, Jeremy Montero. Okay. Everybody, do take care and thanks for watching. Thank you. Enjoy. <laughs> Thank you.